Hey friends out in YouTube land, I uh, finally built the ZVS driver with uh, NTE 2376, 200 volt, uh, 190 watt, 30 amp max. Um, I'm pushing them well past that at about 450 watts. Um, these little 12 volt zeners, I should have put 15s, but they're still working. Uh, the usual 10k and the resistor there is uh, I think 300 or 330 ohm and uh, off the trusty power supply and uh, switched out the amp gauge from a 5 amp to an 8 amp and I uh, just about peg it with this thing um, inside the jar here is a uh, flyback similar to this with the uh, green paint out of a 20 inch TV um, it's merged in motor oil and here's a uh, 2 nanofarad 14 kV cap bank these little guys are tough little bastards I believe they're uh, you can uh, see that and there's Phillips rated at 2 kV each plus two wine bottles into a uh, about a 2 inch secondary Tesla coil. Right now I'm getting about four or five inch arcs off of it and uh, they're quite loud. You know, the primary is about seven or eight turns of uh, I think about 22 gauge wire and uh, my old spark gap in a box. You see I pushed it hard with uh, my big coil. That's uh, out of commission right now until I uh, get some real capacitors for it and then I'll be running it off of uh, twin flybacks so uh, here we go guys um, here's a little voltmeter um, I'm only running at about 45 volts right now um, so let's uh, get it powered up and turn the variac on um, she complains at about 4 amps and I've pushed it to almost 10 and she doesn't get too warm power supply it gets just a little warm I am pushing it way past its limits on amperage it's only rated for 6 amps but that was the old setup the newer setup has a uh, 1000 volt rectifier and their original capacitor rated at 50 volts 15,000 microfarad so uh, let's go Let's get this over with. Get some voltage going. Set it right at about 35 volts. It will drop down when I kick it on. It's probably going to pull 4 to 5 amps. And here is a definite noise warning, guys. Noise warning. Um, I'm going to close the box because it's really noisy. But this is noisier. So let's kill the lights. And this uh, chicken stick route is earth grounded, and so is the bottom of the coil. If my piece of crap phone shuts off because of EMF, I'm very sorry, guys, but uh, I hope you enjoy what comes out in the video. So here we go. That was about 40 volts at about five and a half, six amps off the uh, meter here. I couldn't come too close to it because of the EMF, obviously, guys. But uh, chicken stick spark is about five inches, and it's easily jumping it. 
Let me know what you think, guys. ZVS driven Tesla coil. First try. And I had these capacitors for a couple of years now. I just never put them into use until I had the ZVS going. Um, I'd like to thank everybody out on the internet for uh, putting the Mazzilli together and uh, prove that it works. This one works pretty damn good for me. I will be beefing it up with uh, dual MOSFETs this next time and uh, some 18 volt Zeners. Um, so let's go one more time. Let's turn the Variac down now. A lot of Corona coming off of that right now. Let's turn it up. Actually, let's open up Spark Gut Box and let it breathe. Noise warning, guys. Really loud. Let's get rid of the chicken stick. Run it out of the way. So you guys see just the uh, doorknob. Wow, man, that ozone stinks. Not bad. I want to get better at this and get about 10 inch arcs off of this, and then I'll be happy. Um, I'll probably be re rebuilding the primary, making it couple a little bit tighter, insulating the living crap out of it. But yeah. Simple ZVS driver on oh, the cap, so in there. Um, that's just about one and a half, two microfarads at, uh, I think they're rated, I think, uh, 600 volts, 400 volts, and 250 volt. It doesn't matter. They don't even get hot. These don't even get hot. They're ice cold still. And I just pulled about six or seven amps off of them i'm sorry hit the zoom and a little cheapy inductor it's a weird little inductor it's got a little slice made through it but it still works quite well and uh <clears throat> sorry clear my throat guys the oil still ice cold have a good one guys want to say hi to uh Anthony and Dirk and uh, a bunch of the other guys, whoever's watching. Let me know what you think, guys. Have a good one.